Hey there friends, welcome back to the channel, Creating with Sarah. So today's video is our last unboxing of our Planny Thing Advent Calendar. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This was just a fun, super bonus to add to my holiday planner content. So if you guys wanna see what's in these packages, then keep on watching. Welcome to the channel. I am Sarah, all things creating, planning, yet keeping things fun and functional here on my planner channel. And I'm so glad that you have stopped by. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell if you wanna see more content from me. So I'm so glad you guys are here. Merry Christmas. It is Christmas Eve and we're gonna open up day 20 through day 24. Again, this was an advent calendar by Amber on Planny Thing. I have shared how to use her sticker books in Lots of my planners in different styles and layouts. Hope you guys will check those out. Um, but yeah, so this is her second year doing an advent calendar and it has been a little different than last year's. If you wanna see last year's, I do have that on my highlights on my Instagram. Um, but this year I thought I would throw it in on YouTube. So let's open up these packages. Oh, by the way, I did buy this one myself. I've actually bought the one last year and this one, just to put that out there. So anywho. Let's go ahead and open up day 20. Oh my gosh, this is tiny. It's probably washi. Ah, it is. Oh my gosh, I, I'm really excited about this last couple of packages because if you guys have been watching, you know. Okay, so I'm gonna open this up. It is a beautiful, fall color palette washi so these are really great they're like your extra um just basic washi and so it's not too decorative with the scene or anything like that it's just a really great additive washi if you do a lot of decorative spreads i know that's extra but i don't know it's really pretty i love the colors so pretty so that was day 20. let's open day 21. This is a heavy one. What could this be? So cute. Oh, I didn't even have to like open it. Oh, this is adorable. We have another list pad note by Planny Thing. Look how cute this is. I use these all the time. These can definitely fit in your planner. Um, I have like a agenda ring from Erin Condren and the binder in the back. I bet this could fit in the little pocket. Um, I do have the Erin Condren winter seasonal surprise box this year. It was a folio and that actually fits, but you know, notepads are really great for on your desk, you know, by your family office and you can just write all the things. It's just, these come in so handy. So how cute is this? And it matches, so cute. So that was day 21. Let's open up day 22. Do you guys like my festive here, my little nutcracker? I adore nutcrackers. That's kind of a thing that I collect for Christmas. Absolutely, I got those at Hobby Lobby. They were all different colors, perfect for my office. I do have traditional colors in my living room space, but this year I was able to find some that match my office. Let me know if there's anything that you collect during this time of year for your Christmas decor. All right, I feel like I'm opening this up way crazy. Okay, oh my gosh, adorable. This is her first stamp. Last year she had a lot of stamps and stencils in her Christmas advent uh, calendar, which was definitely all Christmas theme or holiday winter theme. But this year was a little different and I think it's cute and fun and different. And we have a little pumpkin stamp, a little jack o lantern how cute is that? Stamps are really cool and fun. I like using them in my spreads. I like making paper craft um, projects with them. Really cute, you could totally just stamp this on a punched out piece of paper and make some treats for next year for Halloween or something. I don't know, that's really cute. You could do it like a cake cupcake topper or something with this, but. Super cute, I love the pumpkin. All right, so that was day 22. Now let's do day 23. Ah, we have some decorative paper. 
Oh my goodness, so pretty. So this is the fall collection or just it goes with the other days. So we have this beautiful fall scene. It says autumn fills. I love the pumpkin and the rain boots. And then her paper is double sided. So then we have the little pumpkins that matches the other item that we got in last video. Super cute as well as the washi with the stripes. And on this side is my favorite prints. I love this. So cute. Look at all the fallness. Adorable. So that was day 23. Now for the last package. Oh my gosh. Christmas Eve. I hope everyone's having a wonderful Christmas and spending time with your loved ones. Um, but this time of year can be pretty crazy, but I hope that you're taking time for yourself to relax and decompress. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for taking the time of your day to watch this video. So let's get into day 24. So this one actually has the print here, my favorite. Oh my gosh, adorable, I love it. Oh my gosh, super cute. Again, I think these are tents, um, washi tapes, really pretty. This one's my absolute favorite. I love this print, it's so cute. So that was it, that was the whole um, 24 days of planning things, Christmas advent calendar for 2022. I think this was fun. I love the twist. So cute. It was so funny. It's like I opened this early too because I wanted to use some of these items and obviously I can't use the other seasons just yet, but um, I will have them later on to use them. Um, but I love the sticker book. I think, you know, opening the very first couple of packages really was fun for the season that we're in. So if you haven't seen those videos, I would definitely go check them out. I don't want to spoil them for you, but it was so fun and I'm glad I could have you guys tag along. But again, I hope you guys are having a wonderful Christmas. May God bless you in this time of year through the new year and I will see you all in the next one. Take care, stay safe, and happy planning. Bye!